San Jose police believe they've taken some young and very violent gang members off the streets. Today, they announced the arrest of a dozen alleged gang members. After a lengthy investigation, they say it comes at a time when gang recruitment tends to ramp up. NBC Bay Area's Damien Trujillo is in one of the affected neighborhoods with a closer look. The neighbors of Plata Arroyo Park here in East San Jose are applauding the arrests. They say after 2 o'clock, it's the bad element that starts taking the park over. Plata Arroyo Park is a popular summer spot for kids and teens. They gather to test their half pipe skills or for a pickup basketball game. We want our kids to come and enjoy this, learn how to, how to work together, learn how to skate together, learn how to play together. Enjoy the park. That's what it's here for. But the president of the Neighborhood Association says lately all the fun stops after 2 p.m. That's when bad things begin to happen. We've had fights, guns, knives. Jenny Garza says the tagging on the skate park itself is indicative of who really runs the area. So today he's applauding the announcement from San Jose police. Patrol officers and special operations conducted a large scale gang sweep. Uh, ultimately arresting 12 individuals, nine of those being adults. The adults are now in jail and three minors are in juvenile hall. They're charged with a variety of violent crimes, with some facing charges of robberies, attempted murder. Police and neighbors of Plata Arroyo hope the year-long operation that led to the arrests sends a strong message to all gangs as summer arrives. Police say that's generally when gangs start heavily recruiting new members. Gang members target juveniles as early as 10 to 12 years of age to indoctrinate them and bring them into a gang. Police say the investigation started as a response to escalating gang activity across the city. We're really super happy that that happened. The, uh, the fact that they did their due diligence and did a lot of investigation, you know, that really helped. Neighbors say they hope to get their park back and not just for part of the day. Today's news, they say, gets them closer to that goal. In San Jose, Damien Trujillo, NBC Bay Area News.